Dar es Salaam, Tanzania. The children's charity Street Kids International are giving orphans a home. Tanzania is almost three times as big as Germany, but half the population. Many children live in poverty, and it is especially difficult for the thousands of orphans. This is where we help. Street Kids International is a non-profit organization in Frankfurt and has been helping orphans since 2001 purely through the support of donors and volunteers. Since then, we have built several orphanages, schools and a farm. The goal is to provide disadvantaged children with a normal life. Daniel Preuss is the founder of the organization and often travels back to Africa to see the current situation for himself and to initiate further help. Because of this, they have achieved a lot already, but there is a whole lot more to do. A new day begins. Early in the morning, the children have to get ready for school. In this way, the children learn personal responsibility. Communal environment and firm rules are the foundation of raising these orphans. The goal is to help the poorest of the poor children, of whom many have tragically lost their parents and do not have anyone else to look after them. Education is the central component of the Street Kids International philosophy. Without our support, many of the children would not have the opportunity to go to school. But here we give more than a classic education. Independent thinking and behavior play a big role. Street Kids International helps in various locations. 560 kilometers from Dar es Salaam is Madvara, where our secondary school project and boarding school is situated. Street Kids International has been supporting this project since the beginning of 2010. Eins unserer Projekte hier, Street Kids International, eins unserer Partnerprojekte. Das ist eine Secondary School für Kinder ab dem 13. 14. Lebensjahr. Die geht vier Jahre jetzt erstmal. Wir hoffen dann noch die Schule weiterzuentwickeln, damit sie noch zwei weitere Jahre gibt, dass man praktisch ein Abitur machen kann. Ne? Im Moment kann man da bis mittlere Reife machen, wenn man das systemisch vergleicht. One of our partner ja, lass uns mal angucken. Is the secondary school for children up to 14. They attend for four years and we hope to further develop the school so that the children can do their A levels. At the moment, they can study up to an equivalent of GCSEs. Let's take a look. Children travel from all over the country to come to school here. We started to build several years ago. This is the first building. Before, when it was Bushland, here was nothing at all. The fourth building here has two classrooms, then parallel to these. At the other end of the land, the dorming facilities were developed. And all of this has been done in the last four years. One building costs about 20-25,000 euros. As you can see, there are important things kept locked in here. The new school desks. If everything goes to plan, then we plan to build a chemistry lab and the library in the next two years. Space for them has already been made. The U-shape here and the playing field will stay the same. So, Street Kids International gives the children the opportunity to later live their own lives. Do this, of course, with the help of sponsors in Germany. Otherwise, it would be impossible. Every year a new classroom is built and therefore the school is growing constantly. In addition, a vegetable patch was built where children can learn important knowledge about looking after themselves and provides catering for the school. Street Kids International works closely on location with humanitarian aid workers, missionaries and village elders. Staff locally verify the level of need. Daniel Preuss puts great emphasis on the fact that help comes to those who most urgently need it. 
For this, he always personally visits the struggling families when he is on location. Little Sofia is a Maasai and lives, as is customary for these indigenous people, in simple conditions. Her grandmother is very old and already looks after lots of children. She could not manage the extra strain and did not know how she could look after her granddaughter. In addition, orphans are often deemed to have no rights. Without parents, the danger of sexual abuse of these children is extremely high. Mahamudu was in a similar situation. When he was five, he lived with his aunt in this small mud hut. Today, he's visiting his aunt. Both his parents died of AIDS. They had nothing and his aunt did not know how she could continue to look after the little boy. Mahamudu is afraid. The situation is really scary for him. It is awful for him to be where he originally came from. Back to Mandege, where Street Kids International are working on a second children's village. There will be two further orphanages and a Montessori nursery. The project will be finished as early as 2017. Every day more and more children are orphaned. In order to help as many children as possible, Street Kids International needs support. Much has been achieved already, but there is a whole lot more to do. Anyone can help, including you. We will do everything to make things better for the children in Tanzania. So they can live a normal and secure life. That's why we are asking for your support. Get involved.